This year's E3 was a truly exciting show. Filled with amazing announcements and great surprises, there were so many awesome moments at E3. Ultimately though, it's the games that are the highlights of E3, and there were a lot of fabulous games this year. These next five picks are the games I'm most eager to play, whether they come out this year or are a little further off. They all look excellent, and so without further ado, here are my favorite five games of E3 2016. Number 1. God of War Sony kicked off their press conference with the reveal of a new God of War. The moment Kratos appeared on screen, everyone in the audience, including myself, cheered. After a several year rest, the vengeful Spartan is back, and in a completely new setting. This new God of War looks like it will be based on Norse mythology, and will follow Kratos and a young boy on an all new adventure. The combat seems to be completely revamped, the visuals are absolutely breathtaking, and the music, story, and everything else looks incredible. I'm anxious to learn more about the story, given the way God of War 3 ended, and the only thing I hope they change is give the game a subtitle, as just being called God of War could get a little confusing. I'm definitely excited for this new chapter in the God of War series, and this game was by far one of the most memorable moments of E3 2016. Number 2. Horizon Zero Dawn Unveiled in the previous year, we got our first good look at Horizon Zero Dawn at this E3, and I must say it looks stunning. The beautiful open world, thrilling combat, and inventive creature design all look highly intriguing. Set in the far distant future, you play as Aloy and fight for survival against the mechanized dinosaurs of the planet. Setting traps, fighting with bows and spears, hacking and mounting the mecha dinos, it all looks super fun and I can't wait to explore this fascinating new world. This brand new RPG adventure is certainly one to keep on your radar. Keep running for Mother's Crown, it's not far. Come with me, or the demon will kill you. I don't believe in demons and I don't run when lives are at stake. Get out of here. You're crazy! Number 3. Resident Evil 7 Resident Evil has been reinvented once again, this time with a first-person perspective. With many fans wanting the series to return to its more horror-focused elements, it looks like Capcom has delivered and changed up the formula enough to keep it interesting. Like Resident Evil 4, this new Resident Evil game looks to drastically change the way the game is played, while still retaining the look and feel of the Resident Evil franchise. I'm very eager to see how Resident Evil 7 ties into the other games of the series, and if we'll see any returning characters. I've enjoyed both the older and more modern Resident Evil games, and I'm sure that this new entry into the franchise will be just as thrilling and engaging. Number 4. Detroit Become Human Quantic Dream's newest title looks like it could be their best one yet. In this interactive tale, it looks like your choices can drastically change the way certain story scenarios play out. With a plot focusing on androids and the moral dilemma of whether they have the same rights as humans, it looks like the story will be a compelling one indeed. The E3 demonstration just showed one scene and the many possibilities it had. So if the entire game is as expansive as that one scene, this game will certainly be something remarkable. Adventure games and interactive stories are some of my favorite video games out there, and Detroit Become Human looks like it'd be something definitely worth checking out. 
You lied to me, Connor. You lied to me. My name is Connor. This is our story. Number five, The Last Guardian. It's finally here. My moment of sheer happiness at E3 2016 was seeing the release date of The Last Guardian. I literally jumped out of my chair and cheered. After years of waiting and fears that the game may have been canceled, The Last Guardian will at last arrive on October 26, 2016. The spiritual sequel to Ico and Shadow of the Colossus looks like an absolutely magnificent game, and the most recent trailer only added to my excitement. The visuals look astonishing, the story is mysteriously captivating, and the gameplay looks even more refined than before. The Last Guardian has been a long time coming, and we will finally be able to experience it in just a few more months, making it one of my favorite five games of E3. So those were my favorite five games of E3 2016. What were some of your favorites? Feel free to share in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. Until next time, keep having great adventures, everyone.